What happens if you don't sleep at all? In 1964, a 17-year-old high school student set out to break the world record for staying awake. No drugs. No energy drinks. Just pure willpower. He stayed awake for 264 straight hours, that's 11 days without a single minute of sleep. This is the terrifying story of Randy Gardner. The boy who tested the limits of the human mind. It all started as a science project. Randy and two friends wanted to test how long a human could stay awake. Doctors warned them it was dangerous. Even fatal. But Randy was determined. He started on December 28, 1963. Day 1, easy. Day 2, just tired. By day 3 things started to break down. On day 4 Randy began to hallucinate. He thought he was a famous football player. He struggled to speak. He couldn't remember simple words. Doctors and reporters monitored him 24-7. His eyes stopped focusing. He lost balance. His short-term memory almost disappeared. But still, he refused to sleep. By day 7, Randy was functioning like someone with a brain injury. He experienced mood swings, paranoia, slurred speech, visual distortions. He couldn't feel his body. He became emotionally numb. Yet incredibly, he stayed conscious. On January 8, 1964, after 11 days, Randy finally fell asleep. He slept for 14 hours straight. When he woke up, he felt fine. But he wasn't. For years, Randy struggled with insomnia. His brain never fully recovered. And the record, it was never officially broken again because sleep deprivation is now considered a form of torture. Randy's experiment taught scientists a dark truth. The human brain needs sleep. Without it, reality breaks. Memory dies. The mind begins to eat itself. So the next time you think about pulling an all-nighter, remember, you're not just losing sleep, you're losing yourself.